previously on Fallout New Vegas. Thanks to Courier 6, a small town of Good Springs was able to throw together a militia just in the nick of time to fend off an attack from a rowdy bunch of escaped convicts calling themselves the Powder Gangers. Once the dust of battle had settled, the Courier set his sights on the neighboring town of Prim, home of the Vicky and Vance Casino, but more importantly, the last known location of his would-be assassins. Now, unfortunately for the Courier, he'd soon learn that the Mojave was ripe with plenty of trouble. Hey gang, what's good? Welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. We're here in Good Springs, and we are ready to roll out. You know, hmm, should we should we investigate this uh, cross over here? I've only ever been over to it uh, about one time. I think there's some uh, some hybrid animals, some some cross snake cross coyote or something, rattlesnake coyote folks hanging out here. The fucking Animorphs are here in strength, and we gotta watch out for them. Like, see, there's there's one way up there. Holy hell. Look at this dude. Can we, can we snipe him? With our, no. What about, with an actual rifle? The appropriate weapon. Nope, too far, okay. I don't believe there's bullet drop in New Vegas, but I do believe that there is, um, bullet distance. Now, look at that. When we shoot and we change weapons, we reload instantly. Maybe we should abuse that. Man, popped his head clean off. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. What you got? Coyote meat. Ugh. Yeah, we got so much healing stuff. Let's see what's up with this thing, though. I forget what's out here. There's like a shack, I think. Um, I don't know. But it's some kind of... Oh, I think there might actually be a, um, a snow globe out at this thing. I mean, that would make sense, right? Bring up bats here for this guy when he's getting too close. Oh, Jesus! I don't... These ones aren't, like, hybrids, though. <laughs> these ones are just regular coyotes. Mmm. A coyote hide. We'll take it. Wrangle us up something. Man, listen to this fucking sweet-ass music. Holy shit, we're on the fucking safari now, baby. Oh, look at this bastard. Look at him. Oh, I got a crit. Was it a sneak crit? I don't think so. Oh, you've discovered several locations. You can fast travel back to discovered locations using the world map in your Pip-Boy. What's a gullet? Oh, have I have I ever been in, in this? I don't know. I don't know that I have. Oh, look at this. I'm, like, moving when I'm, I'm looking. Did you see that? Look. It won't happen again. Weird. Okay. Let's carefully come on down here. This isn't, like, a, a quest, is it? Here, let's, let's make sure this isn't a quest of some sort. Uh, let's see. Show location. No. I want to make sure we're not beginning the, um... Okay. And... Okay. And... Okay. We don't want to start out on those yet. Just making sure. Gonna try and remember exactly where they're at. Well, that was, uh... Bad timing for that. Ugh. People just throwing trash down here. Ugh, look at all this. Some good stuff. Alright, cool. Motorcycle gas tank. Is there anything else down here? Stow our weapon. You move a bit faster with your weapon. Uh, put oh, look, some Hydra, I think. Yeah. Hail Hydra and all that. No. No, don't, don't hail Hydra. Fuck them. I can't believe what they did with, uh... Eh, never mind. They're, they're going... They're back... They're backtracking on it. Comic books, huh? Alright. Let's see. Anything, uh, no. Looks like the... Oh, look. Oh. Is there something in these? No. Alright, false alarm. There's absolutely nothing in here. Maybe if we head on Wild Wasteland, there would be a skeleton in here of Indiana Jones. I think that's the case. My first playthrough, I had, um, wacky, wild, wacky wasteland or whatever it is on. And, uh, I don't know, I didn't care to it, for it too much. It, I don't know, a little too silly for my taste or something, I don't know. I like some silliness, but it, it's got to be a particular brand. 
All right. Let's continue making our way over here. It's going to suck when we come across landmines for the first time, but I think I remember the the first place we usually come across them. They're on the one of the highways that's looping back up north after Prim. I think after um, Nipton, I believe, if my memory serves me well. Oh, look, they have up a warning sign for uh, Death Claws. Yangshi Memorial. Hello? Hey, guys. What's going on? Anybody out here? Oh. Okay, hello. Uh, let's shoot him in the stinger. Here you go, you sick bastard. You sick son of a bitch. You know you're gonna die, right? Oh, let's do the old... Oh, God. Check this out. Fucking abusing it. Look at this idiot. What are you doing? Am I actually shooting the wall? Ugh. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> and we aren't doing jack shit for damage, are we? Look at this. This fucking scorpion is taking forever to go down. Oh, God! Oh, God! Get the fuck away from me! You sick son of a bitch! There we go. Whew! All right. There should be a globe around here, right? Am I misremembering this? Hmm. Maybe it's up on this pedestal somewhere? No, I don't I don't think so. Huh, let's let's just have a quick once over. Oh look at this. You can actually read some of the names a little bit. Can make them out just barely. Huh. How about that? Oh now this means something, I think. Oh yeah, hollowed out rock. There's absolutely nothing in it. All right, we got some graves over here. Let's rob them. Oh, they're empty as well. This one is not. Oh shit, our biker goggles, finally. An incinerator as well. All right, let's quick save now that we found that good stuff. What is over that way? That's um Oh yeah, that's where the the powder gangers hang out. That's the the prison penitentiary, the jail. Something or the other. Oh, look. Skellyman. Got some ammunition. Future weapons today. Hmm, should we take a las pistol? Yeah, we'll take it. Las pistol. Let's heal up. Hmm. Let's eat some fruit, huh? Let's get fruity. This... What? This hurts us. Why would we... Hmm, that must be a crafting material. Bloat fly, Brahmin steak, sure. What else can we eat here? Scroll bits. Get some dirty water going, there we go. Hmm. Yeah, I could have sworn that there was, um... Jeez, balls wearing off like crazy. Oh, we definitely want to save our pair. Is there really not one out here? Man, I must be, uh, tripping balls like in a major way. Good God, man. Yep, all right. I guess let's move on out. Huh. Oh, no, wait. Oh, that must be, um, yeah, that's what I was talking about. The shack. The love shack. Ooh. Love shack, baby. Oh, and there's, um, that's where we definitely don't want to go. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, it's actually, yeah, you can actually go in it. Oh! Where are you at? Oh. Alright, let's swap. Hmm. Maybe a shotgun ought to be handy here. Oop. Jesus. 
guess we are playing on very hard, huh? We get more XP, though. It's actually a benefit to playing on higher difficulties than this one. I mean, I suppose there was in Fallout 4 as well. You got a higher chance of loot. Alright, look, there's more scorpions down there. We gotta be watchful. Let's quick save as we sneak up in here and spy on whoever's inside. Well, there's probably no one inside. It's abandoned. Might be wildlife, though. Or bombs. A nine iron. Hmm. Flamer fuel. Anything else in here? Doesn't seem to be. Pop on our pit boy light. It's looking pretty freaking empty. Yeah, great. <laughs> hmm. Got some meds. Bitter drink. Duct tape. Oh, scrap electronics and white horse nettle. Okay. Let's, um... Hmm, let's clear up some inventory. Let's repair this sucker. Yeah, that ought to do us for now. But yeah, there's not much in here, huh? Hmm. Weird. I, I, for some reason, I remember there being, like, a... Something worthwhile in here. Maybe it's a snow... Oh, wait. Does this do... No. Alright. Well, let's head on out. Let's see. Where exactly do we want to go? We want to go... Um, let's go to the Good Springs Source, and we'll just travel south from there. Good plan. Great plan. Because we need to actually freaking get to... To Prim! My gosh! We got business to tend to! We gotta track down the checkered suit man! What has he done? Let's see. Oh, we're in caution mode. Here, we should probably bind a different uh, pistol to our one since we have ran out of magnum ammo fighting scorpions. There, we got plenty for that, baby. Alright. Any good stuff out here? Nah. Oh, look, it's our friend. Is this our friend? This might be the dude we want to speak to. Can't recall, though. Maybe it's the same lady from last time? I don't think so. I think she she may have taken off. Let's see, what's in here? Eh, agility. We've already got an agility thing. It's weird seeing the new bed texture. They look like... I don't know, they look like real beds, I guess. Mattresses, so to say. Or, so to speak. Alright, hey, what's up? Are you Are you the one I'm looking for? Hello? Can you help me? Uh, yeah, what's wrong? My girl is trapped by geckos on the ridge. Oh no, I his girl. Please, she's going to die. Do you think he's talking about, like, his girlfriend or, like, his daughter? You, you can never tell when people are like, my girl. Like, well, wait, what does that mean? I don't know what that means. That's not enough information. Go up the path, I mean, I guess pass it the matter. broken radio <laughs> tower and go to the right. They're at the top of the trail. Uh, sorry, that's... It's too risky for me! Ooh, geckos! Not too sure about that! I'll see what I can do. You will? Thank you for helping me. Please hurry. Alright. This isn't even, like, a marked quest, huh? Alright. Let's see. Anything else good around here? We definitely need to save here. There's definitely trouble afoot in this area. Ooh. What have we got? No? No trouble yet. Okay. Well, let's go up there and tend to that shit. Help this guy out. Alright. Let's see, where is it again? I think it's up there past that, yeah. Past that electrical, uh, tower. Is, do you call those electrical towers? I don't know. Cable towers? What would you call that? I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, we'll look for these geckos and show them what for. We'll have a nice big gecko party. Hang out with all of our gecko friends and blast the crap out of them. Good lord. Those poor geckos, they won't know what hit them. Well, here we go. Gecko's showing up on the radar. A gecko dar. A geck dar. The geck. Even so. <laughs> Alright. Oh, their hide weighs something, but not the coyote hide. Worth keeping in mind. Alright, let's see. Where are you, geckos? I'm ready to duel! I'm ready to, to show you what for! Oh god, where are they? Maybe they're, maybe they're stuck in the rock. Are you guys stuck in the rock? Oh no. 
Look at how they run. Ooh. Now, I believe in Vats there's actually a higher crit chance. But um, the drawback is that uh, you spend your condition on your weapons way more. Like, condition depletes really fast. I actually love the way that condition works in these games. Because um, it actually gives you a reason to pick up duplicate weapons. Whereas, like in, um, like in Morrowind that I'm playing, uh, when you find a duplicate weapon, you just sort of either use it to repair up, get some armor or skill, or uh, sell it off. But in Fallout 3 in New Vegas, there's actually reason to hang on to them. And I guess in Fallout uh, 4... baby one. There we go. Look at him go. Oh, let's swap. Eh, they're an interesting tango one. Get them right in their stupid head. Do you think the wings on the sides of their heads help them fly? I like to think that they can fly, and they just choose not to. <laughs> that's yeah, that's exactly what it's for. It's not for hearing or anything like that. The frills. Those are wings, not frills. <laughs> oh, fuck. My little Huzawatsu has run out. Here, let's... Can we, like, bat the shit out of it? <laughs> it's just a little one. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> oh god. Oh no. <laughs> oh, this is cruelty. Oh god. <laughs> That's fucked. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, we're going to hell. <laughs> All right. Oh, oh right, we have a level. Okay. Let me consult my uh my handy dandy notebook here. Alrighty, and looks like lockpick is on the docket. Followed by guns. Well, there you go. Alright. And then we should be able to um pick up uh educated, right? Yeah, there it is. Nice. Yeah, educated is great. One of the best. Let's see. I guess we can eat up on their meat. Eat some gecko meat. Mmm. Just raw. It does reduce our strength, though. Maybe we don't want to eat it. I wonder if we can cook it. Hmm. Let's here. Drink up on uh, some of this garbage. All right. Let's see. Oh, is his girl up here, do you think? Oh, we're here to save her! <laughs> Ugh! What the hell? Oh, man, dude. I got bad news for you, but your girl turned into a Resident Evil. What the hell? <laughs> Jesus! Alright. There's like... There's some little bear traps up here. Oh, look. Caught a gecko. Mmm, gecko egg. A gag. Hmm, a prospector. Alright, cool. Um, let's see, let's grab these. Definitely want all that. Can check this footlocker as well. Merc Charmer outfit, no interest. And yeah, if you have uh, Wasteland on, or Wild Wasteland, there's like, some balls here. It's a reference to something, I don't know what the hell. Oh yeah, and this is where Indiana Jones is. He's in this one. Sorry, that. Um, 
junk right now. Squirrel stew, sure. Sarsaparilla. We could take the wine, but eh. Let's see, there's not anything else up here, right? If I'm not mistaken. Oh, oh god. Can we, like, Skyrim up here? Or is there an invisible wall blocking our path? Huh. Nope, there's definitely an invisible wall. Alright. Okay, let's, um... Oh, look. I don't know if you noticed who it was in the distance. <laughs> let's pull out our, uh... Our fun gun. Hey, man! Sorry I tricked you. But thanks for clearing out the geckos. Now I can get to that stash up there. After I deal with you. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, no! What a tough guy! Barton Thorne! You son of a bitch! You pay for that! Oh, Jesus! Oh my god, he doesn't have a head anymore! Why would you run up to a freaking guy looking like me who has a big-ass shotgun pulled out? Barton Thorne, you idiot. You dingus. What a dungus. What a storm chaser hat. Doctor fatigues. Hmm. Might hold on to that. Let's see. Let's repair up our pistol. Nice. And, hmm, maybe we should, uh... Should we drop some of this fucking gecko meat? I mean, good god. Let's drop a lot of it. Well, two. <laughs> Not exactly a lot. Here, let's wait until, uh, daylight. Let's give it about... Ten hours. That ought to be fine. That way we can enjoy the nice, beautiful, sunshiny, sort of, uh... Path to Prim. Oh my gosh. We can enjoy the fresh texture pack. It's my first time using this texture pack, but, uh... It's pretty popular, and I thought it looked nice when I was perusing around. I don't usually prefer... like using a lot of mods that change stuff, but, uh... Texture packs, I'm alright with. They do fine by me. Here, we should pull out a longer range weapon, shouldn't we? Alright, yeah, we got some geckos on the, uh... On the horizon. Ooh, let's sneak up on them. Fucking geckos. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, look at them. Man, we are really shit at sneaking, aren't we? Look at them go. Which one is coming after us? These ones down here? <laughs> look at them go! Man, I'm more amazed that we're actually getting hits off on them. All right. Well, let's just fucking go in there and, uh, wrestle with them. We'll wrestle with them, these geckers. These gecko fools. Oh, <laughs> fuck. All right. Look at them. Oh, look at them go. They look kind of cute. Not so much when I blow their fucking heads off, though. Ugh. What a noise. Man, you can so easily kite the wildlife, can't you? Forgot how easy it was. Look at this dude, he's running away. Not so fast, you filthy animal. <laughs> Good lord. We're just like carving away through the fucking wildlife. Oh, look. Yeah, I feel kind of bad when they when they just like walk really pathetically. Oh, jeez, I'm a fucking monster. Oh well, when we're out in the wasteland, sometimes it's all you gotta do is is unleash your primal fury on some geckos. Man, look at this dude running away, running like the freaking wind. Good lord! Oh look, he's coming back. Oh, we fell down. Oh gosh, this is a different one. Smack him in the head. Alright. Um, let's see. Shotgun here. Let's... Let's bind our shotgun to five. It's a little bit of a reach. Jesus Christ. Man, they don't want to fight at all! 
Come back, you geckos! Oh, here we go. Good lord, I'm missing left and right. Should be using vats more. I'm, I'm, I want to practice my shots. Did you just see that gecko in the distance fall off the fucking cliff and run at me? Oh look, a 0% chance to shoot him? What the hell is this, XCOM? <gasps> Come on. Oh god, that's a pretty pathetic chance to hit. There we go, let's at least get the four left. Seems we're better aiming down the sights, huh? With the shotgun, at least. Alright. Any other motherfuckers out here? I uh, don't see any. Alright, let's continue on. Onward to Prim. You can see it over there. It's delightful, um... Amusement park. Oh my gosh. Oh, all the fun we'll have. We'll be riding up and down on the sweet roller coaster. The... 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 The Bronken... Bronken Buffalo... Bronk. Ooh. It's a wild one. A favorite among the, the, the folks in the western desert. Whew! It was built back in the times of yore. Ooh, man, jalapeno. Wow. It was built back in the times of yore when, when folks still had carefree lives and, and could enjoy uh, the... Oh, what the hell? There's someone up there. Oh, it's a prospector. Okay. Remember we learned from, uh, old Dynamite Pete. Dynamite Pete. Damn, Pete, you're dynamite! He, <laughs> we learned from him that, that prospectors are actually just scavengers out in these parts. They don't go looking for ore. They go looking for sweet, uh, microchips. They dig in for gold. They buy, like, shitloads of Game Boy Advance games and, like, rip them apart for hey the there. gold chips inside and melt them down. Hey there. Hey there. Howdy. Oh, okay, howdy. Can we... You got anything, uh... Can we, uh... That doesn't belong to you. Oh. Whoops. <laughs> we'll just pretend that didn't happen. <laughs> Alright. Grab some Brock Flyer. I really shouldn't be trying to pickpocket as much as I am with uh, my sneak so low. Eventually we'll get our sneak up, but for now, probably not a good idea. Oh, it's the, um, the electronic shack isn't here yet, is it? Or is it further up a ways? Is it... Did we miss it? No, I think... It must be further out a bit. After Prim, huh? Alright, let's get down here. <coughs> oh my god, that almost wasted me. <laughs> I'm used to my Morrowind character. Oh god, he can take a bit of a fall. Let's see, maybe that'll be enough. Alright. Let's see. Ah, yes. The two bears banging each other. <laughs> it's definitely not a two-headed bear. Oh, look. Hey, where the hell do you think you're going? Prim is off limits. Um. What's going on in Prim? Some convicts from the prison up the road have taken over the town. Everyone inside is either dead or in hiding. What's more, there are two tribes of raiders causing trouble in this area as well. You'd be safer heading back up to Good Springs. Uh, shouldn't you be protecting the town or something? We'd love to, but they don't fall under NCR jurisdiction. Even if they <laughs> did, we're in no shape to protect them. Um... Why can't you protect them? We don't them? have the equipment to take out the convicts. And even if we did, we need some extra hands for backup. You should talk to Lieutenant Hayes. He's in a tent down the road. Just stay on the west side of the overpass if you don't want to get shot. Yo, man, I bet I can go in there and fucking Rambo this shit. One man army, roll up in there and blast them all. What the hell are you guys doing out here? Alright, here we are, Prim. Beautiful, sunny Prim. Just in time to take all their fucking shit. <laughs> they got a lot of ammo, alright? It's totally worth taking. Mm. Alright, let's see around here. Uh, anything up here? I can't remember if there's, uh, ammo crates up here. No? Alright. Jeez, that, um... That water didn't do me too well. I might need to find a bed. Maybe we'll be able to use one of the beds in here. 
Oh no, we can... Oh no, okay. We can't drink from that. Fair enough, I guess. Yeah, there's some hidden stuff in here. First aid. Oh, doctor's bag, not bad. Alright. What else? There should be a sa Yeah, here it is. I think there might be a second safe. I keep wanting to take duct tape from my, uh... Time playing Fallout 4. Always taking duct tape. Just a duct tape addict. Just walking around with, like, rings and... Rings of duct tape all over my arms and legs. Just ready to rumble. That's the ultimate bulletproof vest. That's the real armor is just... Rolls and rings of duct tape. You call them rolls or rings? I like calling them rings. It'd be like... <laughs> Be like Sonic the Hedgehog. If you if you get shot, you drop some of your duct tape on the ground, and you have to run around picking it up. <laughs> All right. Hmm. I thought this one you could go like to the upper floor. Oh, yeah. There we go. Yeah. Jeez, I just walked right by it. All right. Let's sneak here and grab some more. Ooh, 308. Always good. Those are sniper rounds, I think. <clears throat> oh, here we go. Here's the bed. Nice. We only gotta sleep for one hour, and we're, yeah, fit as a fiddle. We are fit as a fiddle. Alrighty, folks of Prim. I'm here to save the freaking day. Hello. Sergeant McGee. I'm Sergeant McGee of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. If you want to talk about something, speak to Lieutenant Hayes. Where are you from? I'm from Hub originally, but it's been a long time since I saw it. I'm on my second tour here. Most non-commissioned officers are. The hub, I, I think, was present in, uh... It was either Fallout 1 or 2, I can't re I can't remember. Maybe both. Sir. Probably both. Why not both? Alright, let's see here. They got some cooking pans. Oh, man. I need to get one of those and strap it onto my butt. That way I don't get shot in the butt. Man, what a, what a callback. Whew! That sweet Player Unknown's Battlegrounds reference. Everybody loves it. Damn. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> Alright. Let's see here. Oh. Uranium Rush. I don't remember that. That must be uh, part of the texture pack, huh? Alright, let's see. Is this the main tent? No. But it does have some sweet shit we can take. Ooh, look at that. 556, five, baby. Let's see, what else have we got? Regular toolbox. Oh, we got some, some junk in here. A goggles helmet. Oh, yeah, we should really equip those goggles from earlier. Alright. Let's see. Biker goggles. How do we look? Do we look good? Oh, God, we look like a fucking idiot. <laughs> well, let's fucking drop the shit out of those. I don't want them. <laughs> you guys can have that. It's on the house. Alright. Head on in here. Hello. Ah, here you guys are. Sure. Let's see. Can we, uh. Wow. Oh, nope. Hang on. <laughs> God, I love this game. <laughs> Alright. Nice. 10 millimeter, baby! Alright. What's up, Hayes? I'm Lieutenant Hayes of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. What's your business? Uh, what are you doing out here? We were sent out here to hold back the tide of convicts from the correctional facility. You're doing a fun job. As you job. can probably tell, we aren't doing the kind of job we could be doing. Uh, what's the problem with your mission? The mission isn't a problem. The problem is with supplies. The convicts are better armed and organized than our intel initially suggested. I'm trying to get some reinforcements here, maybe some guns with some firepower, but... Shit. Things are just going slow. Uh, tell me about the correctional facility. Most people just call it NCRCF. That's NCR Correctional Facility. A little bit ago, the convicts there staged a coup. Killed the guards that weren't able to escape. And have been ransacking the area since then. Uh, do you have any information on the convicts? Not much. They've taken to calling themselves powder gangers. Mostly because they've taken to using the explosives meant to clear boulders as weapons. They got organized faster than I would have thought. Most of them, at least. Thankfully, the small group in town here seemed to have split off from the main force, so they aren't getting anything in the way of support. Uh, hmm. Some other questions. I have some... F oh, no, I don't. Sir? I lied. All right. Let's it's see up. here. Um, let's see. Huh. 
Owing the Mojave almost makes you wish for an. You'll probably want to talk to Hank. I can't get a quest yeah. from him. I thought I, I I was able to get a quest from this dude. Hmm. Yeah, I suppose not. Days. All right. Well, f it, man. We're heading up in there. Oh yeah, we, our quest is uh set to take us in there. Alrighty, let's quick save here. Get the varmint rifle at the ready. Should probably swap our our weapons, huh? Or our ammunition type. You lost. <laughs> what a fucking guy. All right. Nah, I'm not lost at all, man. <laughs> Ooh. Sneak around his his butt area. Ooh, I think he almost saw me there in that last one, huh? Alright. Now in this one, there are definitely mines. I was mistaken that th this is actually the first mine area. Alright, let's see if we can't grab some. Nice. What's our equipment weight at, by the way? All right, we should have enough to be able to just grab all the mines real quick. Whew! Man, still got it, baby! Are there any more down there? No, but there is ammo. Ooh. Man, before we forget, let's sneak down there and grab that ammo. All right. Let's, ooh, we should probably... Yeah, we should be sneaking, just in case. Nice, good stuff. Anything else? I don't think so. I think that's it. All right. We'll head on up there. Can we actually sneak up this away and just skip by all that bullshit? Oh no, okay. Wow, look at that. Some game design there. Look, they intentionally put that in there to block you off. Clever. All right. That's another interesting thing about um these early Encounters, they're very much um, like a stereotypical uh, Western movie. Like, you know, there's a... Oh, the cowboy is, is wounded and taken in, to, in by a town, but then the town's got some troubles of their own. Oh no, the cowboy's roaming into a new town, and uh-oh, there's bad guys everywhere. They've taken the, the town hostage. It's a standoff between the local enforcement and the the hot, and the, the banditos. And then the the, cow, the the Lone Ranger comes in and, and saves the day. Woo-wee! <laughs> I don't know. I was always kind of into that. All right, let's see. Are these? Where are these fuckers? Do you see them? Popping vats left and right. If I can't see them, my robot, my robot arm, my my pit boy will see them. Hello? All right. Well, before we go over there and save the day, let's rob the shit out of everyone. <laughs> because we definitely want to hit up this shack. I believe there's some good stuff in these, these two over here. All right, let's see. Yes, the deputies. Deputy Beagle. God, his his delivery on 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 one of the voice tapes is so fucking bad. <laughs> oh God, hopefully we'll be able to hear it. All right, let's see. Crutch. Oh, some grilled mantis. Here we go. This is what we want. Man, check out how many bobby pins we've got already. Twenty four. We only just started. Let's repair up our pistol. Look at that. We're at the threshold now. Okay, anything else? I could have sworn there was um something else in here. Like a cowboy hat or some such. Guess not. Maybe I'm thinking of something else. Should we check his fridge? Why not? Oh yes, pears! Hell yeah, baby! <laughs> Do you like that? Uh, how I'm doing the new baby thing? I don't know. Maybe it's insufferable. I fucking love doing it now. <laughs> it's my new thing! Alright. Let's have a look over here. Ah, yes. Old Bison Steve! <laughs> Great name for a bison. Oh shit, have they spotted me? Let's fucking shoot this bastard. Like I said, there's bullet curving. Look at this. We're shooting right at him. But no dice, huh? Uh-oh. Now, these cars are already blown up, right? He's not gonna blast my ass. Oh, shit! He is gonna blast my ass! 
Let's see, how, what's our shot chance from way back here? Ooh, garbage. Ooh. All right, hold up a second. We got just the uh, the thing for the occasion. Ooh, should we should we use the? Uh... <laughs> no, probably not. Probably not. We'll save it for a really sticky situation. Here we got seventeen versus twelve. Okay, let's use this one. All right, can we get a good shot on him with vats? No, we can't. Not at all. Gotcha. All right, let's heal up a bit here. Where'd the other guy go? Oh, look at him. What's he doing down there? What are you doing, you dingus? Oh, is he surrendering? Help! Not today, you filthy animal! Get your ass back! What the fuck? He went inside! Oh, you sack of shit! What a bastard! What a rat bastard! Ooh, did you hear that? Help! Help! How did I miss him? Oh my god! This is hopeless! Yeah, that's right, you son of a bitch. You fucking annihilated these poor people. You've been annihilated back. Alright, let's grab his shit, huh? Ooh, a metal spoon. Mrs. McBain's corpse. Oh, dear God. Yeah, I think when you come in here, what you hear is their bodies going, like, exploding. Their heads exploding, because they spawn into the world with their heads. And the game is just like, all right, the player's entering here. Better blow their heads clean off. And, and then you just hear it go... Pfft. Oh, nice. The sheriff's hat and duster. Ooh, we should wear that, shouldn't we? Let's see. What's our current one at? DT of 8. Sheriff's duster. Oh shit, it doesn't really give us much. But the hat for sure we gotta wear. Eh, we look alright. Until we get something that's uh, really good, maybe we ought to just keep this look. It's a fine look, don't you think? Alright. Let's see, what else is in here? Turn on our light. That way we can mosey on around in here a bit better. Should we take the Brahmin skin? Nah, no, fuck that. All right, let's uh let's rest for a bit with these fucking dead bodies. Heal up, you know. Let's see, agility and endurance. Yeah, we've already got one of those, right? Let me just double check here. Yeah. Anything up there worth taking? Nah. Let's see. Oh, some ammo. Three oh eight. Always good. Well, actually, I don't know. I know I know sniper rifles use that, but uh, I don't know that any of the guns that we're going to be using actually. Uh, allow for me to use the 308 the reloading station. If I ever do reloading stations, they'll probably be uh, off camera. Ah, look, <laughs> Jesus, we got our uh, we got our settings on maximum, and we're using the texture pack, but still. <laughs> All right, what's in here? Carton of cigs. Very good. Oh, God. This weapon situation is getting a little out of control. <laughs> we should have sold some shit off in Good Springs. We might run back and do that, you, you know, now that I think of it. Hmm. Gosh, we have a shitload of these. I mean, we are carrying around 41 units of, <laughs> of sarsaparilla. Oh, my God. Hmm, do we have any, like, alcohol? Yeah, we do. There we go. Grab that. Alright. Where's that dead guy? Who was out here? There he is. A huh, rawhide cowboy hat. What's it look like? Looks like trash. Doesn't look nearly as cool as the sheriff's. There's a new sheriff in town. All right, what have we got here? We can, uh, can we repair it with... No, we can't. Let's drop it then. All right, let's quick save here and actually fast travel real quick back to, um... Actually, here, let's see. Have we have we discovered somewhere that... Yeah, we do have Prim. All right. So let's fast travel back to Good Springs and sell some stuff real quick. Um, let's see. Good Springs itself. Yep. 
Yeah, we'll, we'll, if they don't have any money, we'll just uh, buy ammunition. We'll trade our weapons for ammo, huh? I think that's a good idea. Hey there, Pete. It's me again. I'm just coming by. Gonna see if Trudy's got her caps back in stock. Too bad we can't uh, trade with Pete. Feeling thirsty? I can take. Shit, she doesn't have it back. All right, let's head on. Um, let's head to Chet. Fuck me. Fucking Chet. What a character. See if he's got, uh, he probably won't have his stuff back, but we can at least barter for, uh, ammunition. Even if we don't use the ammunition, you never know, might need it for a rainy day. You looking to buy some supplies? Ammunition is weightless. Can at least in this difficulty. Alright, let's see. Let's get rid of, um, hmm. I guess we can ditch the SMG. I don't know, it's pretty high DPS for, uh, yeah, we'll hold on to the SMG, actually. Um, let's see. Sturdy caravan shotgun? Yeah, we'll keep the sturdy one and ditch these other shotguns. Should we keep the incinerator? Yeah, let's keep the incinerator. We could have some fun with that. Um, and the grenade launcher? Sure, we'll ditch, ditch that. Let's see, what do you have, Chet? Do you have anything worth buying? Hmm. Doesn't really look like it, does it? Could buy stim packs from him, always good. Wow, we bought quite a lot from him, actually. A katana protective sheath. I don't remember there being katanas in this. Let's see. Miscellaneous here. Dump our poison glands. Coyote hide. Cigarettes. Let's see, apparel. We could get rid of some of this, but I kind of want to just keep it. Okay, we'll ditch the, um... Hmm. I don't know. Yeah, we'll keep it for now. Let's see, we can ditch some, uh... Do we still have that gecko shit on us? Yeah, we may as well get rid of that. He doesn't really have any ammo that we use either. I mean, he has the magnum, but they're hollow point, which... It's a little too, uh, too beyond us. Give me a shout if you need anything else. All right, chat, Dang. whatever. You bastard. All right. Let's head on back to Prim and save the freaking day! After our little shopping spree. Don't worry, they're, they're fine. The hostage situation, they didn't notice I, I shot the people outside. It'll be totally fine. They'll never suspect a freaking thing. All right. Let's see, are there any other folks out here? Hmm, I don't believe so, no. All right. Let's head on into here and rescue them, so to speak. Now, I think there's, um, there should be a, a unique weapon in here, if I remember correctly. It's either a revolver or, oh. I don't know what it was brought you to Prim, youngster, but you might want to rethink your plans. Town's gone to hell. Uh, who are you? Johnson Nash is my name. <laughs> he just... Husband to Ruby Nash. <laughs> Lived in Prim going on eight years now. I think it's the same Prim. voice actor, but he I'm just... I'm a trader primarily, for what it's worth with things like they are. I also run the local Mojave Express outpost. Mmm. Hey, I'm a courier with the Mojave Express. Well, I don't got any work right now, sorry to say. I lost a package I was supposed to deliver. I'll tell you whatever I can. You have a delivery order you can show me? Do I? Oh, I do. What can you tell me about this job? Oh, so you're talking about one of them packages. That job had Strange written all over it, but we couldn't turn down the caps. Hmm. Um. Some men stole my... Or what was Strange about it? Yeah. That cowboy robot Ooh. had us hire six couriers. Each was carrying something a little different. Paradise, chess piece, that kind of stuff. Last word I have in the office, it looked like payment had been received for the other five jobs. Guess it was just your chip that didn't make it. First deadbeat we hired to do the job, canceled. Hope a storm from the divide skins him alive. 
Well, that's where you came in. He canceled? Yeah, got this look when he saw you next down on the courier list. His expression turned right around, asked me if your name was for real. I said, sure as lack of rain, you were still kicking. Then he turned down the job, just like that. I asked if he was sure it was good money. No, let Courier 6 carry the package, that's what he said. Like the Mojave'd sort you out or something. Then he just up and walked out. Hmm. I, I believe this has to do with, um, with the DLC. Um, do you know where who he was? Where he went? No idea. Sounds like you two had a history for him to act like that. And turn down the money, too. Hope he didn't see any trouble in that package of yours. No, oh, there's Maybe tr plenty of trouble in this package, luck. Nash. Enough for me to say. Johnson Nash. Uh, some men stole my package! <laughs> A man in a checkered suit and some thugs. Did they pass this way? Well, now that you mentioned it, a few nights back, one of the townies was out scavenging for supplies. He said he saw a fellow with a daisy suit come through with some of a them great con suit. misfits. They was talking about a chip. One of those men shot me. I need to know the best way to get to him. Well, for that, your best bet is going to be talking to Deputy Beagle. Since they came to town, he was keeping a good bit of notes on him. And he was slinking around Bison Steve when your pretty boy friend came through. He may have heard where they were going. Uh, ask about something I guess else. I don't have anywhere better to be. Um. Hmm. What can I do to help Prim? Right now, Beagle is the closest Prim's got to any organized law. But he's still stuck up in Bison Steve. First thing I'd say is get his sorry butt out of there. Um, let's see. I think these are these first two are just reminders. Let's a see. Beagle had some notes he was taking while he was eavesdropping around the Potter gangsters. He'll be your best source of information on that subject. I want to ask you more about the delivery I was supposed to make. Sure, I'll tell you what I know. Nah, okay, yeah. Something else. And... Does he have anything? Why do you, why do you keep calling them gangsters? I thought they were called Potter Gangers. Gangers, gangsters, all sounds like trouble to me. <laughs> what a weird line. It's like, it's like instead of co correcting him misreading, the, like the actor misread the line, they just, I don't know, they just had to put in this one instead. I don't know. It's a weird, what a weird thing. Because nothing ever comes of that. All right. I have some questions uh, about Prim. Well, I'll answer what I can. Jeez, he wasn't he wasn't into that. Uh, do you know where I can find the courier office? Sure do. I run the courier office out of my shop. Leastways I did before things went to hell around here. Um, uh, let's see. More questions about Prim. Ask away. Um, what happened to Prim? Let's see. Been tough around here for a good while now. Worse since them thugs kidnapped our deputy. It started with the breakout from the prison up the road. First, there was just a few thugs rolling through town, but then they got organized. Hmm. Now they call themselves powder gangsters or something <laughs> and run around throwing dynamite <laughs> and shooting people. Little while Damn it, ago, Johnson Nash, get it right! left whatever kind of organization they got up there to squeeze all the food and drink out of us they could. Nah, I, I like Johnson Nash. Johnson Nash, his, uh, his voice actor is, is dope. All right, let's see. Can we ask more about Prim? Let's see. What What is the Bison, Steve? What's a bison? It's an old hotel and casino here in town. Old Laura used to rent out rooms there, but she took off months ago. Across the way from the Vicky and Vance, the other old casino. Can't miss it. Um, let's see. More questions about Prim? Vicky and Vance, what's a, what's a Vicky and Vance? That's where we are. This here little casino brought some cash and bodies into the town before them powder gangsters came in. Damn they it, can't Nash! rush us without eating a good bit of hot lead, but we are in a kind of box canyon. Guess this is a fitting place for that as any. I reckon that if they thought hard enough about it, they'd realize they got more bodies than we have bullets. But for now, we're safe enough in here. All right. Um, let's see. Is there anything else we can ask about Prim? No. Something else. <laughs> 
Um... You say Powder Gangers kidnapped Prim's deputy? Well, you can call Beagle a deputy so long as you don't harbor too high an opinion of the word. That's a, such a Boy good line. Boy was about as useful as tits on a rat scorpion. <laughs> Only qualification he ever had was to be I don't remember to that line. Sure. <laughs> Still, I suppose he don't deserve what's befell him. We would have considered paying the ransom if we'd had caps to spare. <laughs> tits on a rat scorpion. Mmm. Scorpion milk. Mm. Sure, have a look. <laughs> that is foul. All right, let's see. Johnson Nash, what have you got? Ooh, I can't remember if that's good. Hmm. We'll buy it just in case, because you can you can customize your deck later on. I still haven't gone on to uh, check. Wow, look at all this. Maple body, nails, chainsaw alloy. All right. Uh, cowboy repeater. Ooh, the, the dopest weapon of all. Hmm. King of diamonds. I know, uh... Royal cards. Is that what you call them? You don't call them royal cards. You call them, like, face cards or something? Those are all good. Let's see. Anything else? What did he have in the way of ammo? Hmm. Some magnum rounds. Maybe we buy them. Why not? Alright. Alright. Cool beans. Let's uh let's sell these mines to him as well. Hmm, maybe we should get rid of this incinerator. No. We'll have fun with it first. Another satisfied customer. <laughs> yeah. Like I said, Bye. I'll check out uh I'll try and reacquaint myself with Caravan later on. Alright. Now before we uh we close this out, next time we'll come in here and we'll we'll talk to everybody else before we uh finish this. But, before I forget, I want to sneak on over here and, uh, get this sweet gun that I remember being in here. Let's see, can we access it from here? No. Alright, let's... let's see what we can do here. There we go. Nice, alright. Alright, it should be in one of these. A single shotgun now. I mean, we can just take all of that. Let's see. Oh, is that it? No. Man, we are doing a fucking heist. For real. Alright, let's see. Ooh, safe hard. Is it in that one? Man, it might be in the hard safe. I don't recall. Oh, what was that? Varmint rifle up there. Okay. Huh. How do we get into the hard safe, though? That's what I want. Let's see here. Is there anything up top there? Or inside these? Because it's definitely in one of these safes. There's still a switchblade in there, but I have no interest in that. Hmm. Be easier if I had my light on, huh? <laughs> Keep forgetting about that. Still in the Morrowind mode. The Morrowind state of mind. Alright. Hmm, let's see. Can we boost up? We should be at 50, right? Oh, 52. Okay. Hmm. I don't think we can quite boost up there, can we? Because, um, let's see. It was, it's tumblers today, right? I think it is. Or locksmith's digest or something like that. Hmm, yeah, we can't, we can't break in just yet, can we? All right. Well, shoot, I thought we were going to get ourselves a nice uh, revolver. I think it was a revolver. I may be mistaken. All right. Well, when next we come back, we'll uh, we'll poke around here. The rest of uh, Prim have word with everybody in here, and uh, we'll continue on into the freaking uh, Bison Steve and gun down everybody in there. Holy smokes! I hope you're ready for a freaking reckoning, you 
powder gangsters. <laughs> Till next time, peace. Peace.